The Provincial Executive Council of the Tutumang ended down the budget of 373 million kina late yesterday. The budget increased by 23 million kina from the 2013 250 million kina provincial budget. Almost half of the budget will go towards the development of infrastructure, health and education in the province. 276 million kina came from the national government's grant while the provincial government is expected to come up with about 96 million kina from its internal revenues. The Morobe governor says areas that will stimulate economic growth in the province over the next two years will get most of the money from the budget. Like the national government's policies ended down in November, the Morobe provincial government has also aligned its goals and priorities along the same path. Roads and bridges will get 13.5 million kina, a decrease by about 5 million kina from this year's budget. Education and health will get 9 million kina each. The Tutumang has also pushed for the inclusion of the SMEs through its economic sector. 4.5 million kina has been set aside for this. Law and order will also get 4.5 million kina. The provincial government also expects to make additional revenue internally. Nearly 77 million kina will come from the goods and services tax. Bottle shop owners will contribute about 1.5 million to the provincial government's money box. Car owners in Lei will also contribute nearly 9 million kina through traffic registry. The Morobe provincial government also expects to make FT returns from other business projects in the province, such as the Makam oil palm project in the Makam district. According to a budget document at least, if the Tutumang plans turn out successful, Morobe province can end up with a budget of over a billion kina in two years. Edwin Fidelis, National MTV News, Lei.